Hey guys, it's your boy Crypto, and welcome to Black Tail. This is a game I've been wanting to play for a while now, so we'll see what it's like. I know nothing about this, but from a brief look at the trailer and the screenshots, I it almost looks like you're playing in the role of who the fuck's the boy's name in God of War. Oh, okay. What the fuck's the guy boy's name in God of War? Atreus. If it's not, I'm really stupid. <laughs> but yeah, it's always something you're playing in the uh, first person perspective of Atreus and God of War. So you're with the bow, I think? I don't know, but at this point, let's just get into it. I got nothing else to say. I like the main menu music. <laughs> uh, so I was obviously turning that on. Tutorials, yes, because I have no idea what I'm doing, so. <laughs> I mean, gamers are alright for me, but I'm just wondering if you guys can see this. Oh. That might be an interesting choice. Full back to experience or focus on story and explore the world. Um, I obviously don't know what's the recommended option here. Okay, so I just looked it up. I think adventure is the um, way to go here, so let's do it. Well, that's interesting. Once upon a time, there were two twin sisters, Zora and Yaga. Hold on a second. Why is my Streamlabs OBS that laggy when it's recording? Why is my computer lagging so hard? Or is it slightly better? It's still not greatest. I... okay. Try this again, I suppose. It was well past curfew. My sister sneaked out of the village. I followed her. As I always did. I took my bow. I don't know. Okay. One, one second, guys. <laughs> I'm just saying, by the way, can that be a bigger tutorial screen note of to push E? <laughs> Jesus. Okay. That's a bit big for a um, tutorial button. This just... You're playing as the Yaga. kid from... I'm coming. God of War. Seriously, looks like it. Oh, boy. Well, this would be interesting. Cool environment, I like the graphics. Something's ahead. What the fuck is that? It's what? I'm sorry, but what the fuck button is that? <laughs> I just run up to you. Ow, my face. I'm sorry, but push what? Oh, dash. Okay. Friends. What am I picking up? I'm just dropping some weird crystal thing. Okay, this is real. well. Obviously, I couldn't shoot them because I got no fucking arrows. So. I always make arrows myself. This time wasn't any different. All I needed was some sticks and feathers. Okay, the audio on the birds is a little strange. <laughs> it almost sounded like that was all around me. How many fucking sticks am I gonna carry? Do I need a stick button? And a bit of work to put them together. Bacon. Stick. Stick. Those they look like fucking ant with things, but you know. Okay, well that's a crafting screen. What's that? Does it tell? But uh, uh, Max, I suppose. Zora is always up to something. Can you see it? See what? The tree. 
the red oak. No, I don't see any tree about the normal one. The water. red oak. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> uh, briefly tap for a short distance. Hold for a longer shot. Hold until charge for a power. And right click to aim. Hold up, cancel. We've often used it for target practice. You're not wrong, you are using it for target practice. <laughs> uh, wait, just just watch one of the achievements just be pick up every single fucking piece of resource in this game. <laughs> oh no, watch it be one. Take a good look at it. If anything bad happens, always head straight to the Red Oak. I will meet you there. Uh, Zora? Was it you? Can't stand a second without a leash around your neck. How about you finally go down your own path? I never wanted to harm anyone. I still don't want to. I always try to do what's right. Trying is all you could ever do. <laughs> you got it all wrong. Once upon a time, there was a freak with no face. Ooh, How much longer you want to be a nobody? You just follow in your sister's footsteps. How far will you go when she's not around? Zora's got a, a plan. She always has one. It's time you had a plan. You wanna hide? Here, in the woods? You can't hide from Baba, princess. I, I just need to find the Red Oak. The Red Oak. <laughs> if anything bad happens... Stop it! Then forget the goddamn Oak! What you really wanna find is... The Hut. What? Hi. Is it drilling into your little head? The hut. The hut. We get it. The hut. <laughs> Just another bad dream. That was all a dream. Okay. I haven't had a good night's sleep since Laura went missing. But first, I have to get some food to get my strength back. I'm sorry, what? It just looked like when I put that mask on, it the world just replenished itself. That's that looks cool, but that's also terrifying. <laughs> uh, okay. Hunt there to get some meat. Oh no, I kept the buddy. I don't think I kept any of the stick that I gathered, but no. Why is. Why do I have an eyeball? What's the eyeball? Okay, skills. Oh my fucking Jesus. <laughs> morality! <laughs> Commit deeds of good or evil to tilt your morality. Your moral stance will affect some of your skills. This is. Yeah. There, there's a certain place that will judge you every time you visit, altering your moral stance. Right, so... Oh, so goody. There's a light and a dark side, by the sounds of it. Not Star Wars at all. <laughs> um, so, is it gonna... Is, does this game kind of have a mass effect mechanic of choosing whether you're Paragon or Renegade. Okay, this is fucking a bit more than the this game is a lot. <laughs> <laughs> People. Two legs, two arms and a head mostly. Okay. Yaga? 
She does not cast in a recall, so one of the orphan turns away is by a foster family in the village. Her face appears a strange birthmark causing superstitious villagers to antagonize her. The least popular of the kids are always a punchy bag shunned and mocked. That's great. Ashamed of her appearance, she chooses to hide behind a mask. She believes the mask and her braces' protection are the only things shielding her from the cruelty of the outside world. She's not necessarily wrong there. Rejected by her community, she chose paths less travelled. And with them, a life of survival and the hunt. Okay, you can actually stop your life for once in your life. Yaga's lost... I'm assuming I'm saying that now, right? Yaga's lost twin sister. She is the bright one, the loud one. We said the old one for some reason. <laughs> the leader and the protector, the one keeping Yaga safe from the villagers superstitions and bigotry. What the fuck does bigotry mean? Let me look that up. <laughs> her disappearance tipped the scale. Yaga could no longer feel safe in the village. The only option was she was left with was to set out into the wild in search of Zora. Disappear without a trace. That might be a problem to try and look for. Disappear as well and vanish. Oh, the bully. <laughs> great. <laughs> Barbara the Witch. That sounds great. What was that? Oh, that's what that thing was. The bloody god neck are covered in a piece of slime that makes anything that comes in contact with them awfully sticky. Be careful not to step on one of these during the fight, as that would temporarily slow me down. Yay! An irreplaceable shield, protecting Yaga from unfavorable looks, yet attracting more of them. She's had it for as long as she can remember. The animalistic pattern calls back to the days of the old days forgotten. I'm not sure what that scene is. Perhaps rightly so. Yep, yeah, the bow. Just a bow. What? What's <laughs> it? So this is seven arm. Oh, there's the eye. Doesn't say much what it's used for, but it's just weird. Yeah, there's a lot to this game. <laughs> Whoa, audio. I have to go hunting to get some meat first. Alright, now I need to find a deer, apparently. I keep having nightmares since Bob the Witch started snatching kids from the village. Volko, Slavitsa, Dragoy. Okay, that's a safe point. Moises. Yeah, there's a lot of this game that I thought there was, that's for sure. I'm just hoping it doesn't, you know. I was up to something yeah, there. Let me just make that clear. I mean, I don't want to harsh the developers of any game, but there are certain games out there nowadays that of this quality have been a bit of a letdown. I'm just hoping this game doesn't do that. Right now, Empress, what are you doing? I just shoot the bird. <laughs> but yeah. I'm gonna hold my breath, I'm gonna make it through this game first before I do any sort of review of it. I've <laughs> only really just started fucking playing. Let me try something. Can I just shoot the bird? Woo! Oops. <laughs> um. Oops. Where'd it go? <laughs> I 
Alright, my choices matter. Got it. That might have been a bad decision. Was it? I don't fucking know. Does it simply tell you? <laughs> that may have been a mistake. Oh, okay. Oh. Hello. What's your problem, little one? It looks like it wants the fruit. It's like a little hedgehog that stole That's my good deed for the day. Shoot it. <laughs> that seriously just looked like a fucking um hedgehog. We have a ton of in New Zealand. Not where I live right now, but yeah, it turns out like the countryside. Oh, it's a big one. I hope I can take it down. Do I have to? I gotta just attempt to get, I don't know, a crop or something. I wanna shoot a deer. Deer, deer are majestic. What the fuck is this? Why is it? Crystals growing out of a well, that makes sense. I always find this type of weather interesting, but. Hi. I'm sorry? I have no idea what I just shot. <laughs> Grab it, hold on. Wait! Okay. So I don't know. Wait, did I shoot it? No? Okay. So, what was that I just picked up? Hold on, there was something in the Alamac for that. Yeah, that's a save shrine. Uh, resources. Was there something or is there nothing? I guess I'm not. <laughs> Alright, let's move on. Let's move on that. So. Struggling to see a little bit. Just in the mainly dark areas, but yeah. Hello. <laughs> that. Oh god, follows you, that's kind of creepy. How am I supposed to get to you? Or do I just shoot it? I think I just sh shoot it, right? I'm gonna assume that. And eh, doink. Still don't know what that is, so it'd be great if the game told me. Wait, do these just respawn? Okay, well. I'll didn't mean to pick that up on four hours, yes I know. Huh. Uh, yeah, as I was saying, I find this weather kind of interesting, I don't know why, just... It's raining, but it's sunny. I don't know, this just seems a little strange. Why is it sunny when it's raining, you know? I can't go back. Not without Zora. No kids. Alright, so I need to find a long lost sister, apparently. Yes, I know about Troll. <laughs> That's a really interestingly shaped deer, I have to say. I'm sure they just shoot it from here, right? He's tough. It'll need more than one shot. Noted. Your blood won't go to waste. I don't want to do that, that's mean. Oh, uh, okay. I suppose. Get some You'll deer meat, I suppose. Forever now. Because we... are one. Now meat goes over the fire. I'm hungry.
<laughs> don't like that at all. I'm good. Thank you. <sighs> yeah. Okay, uh, what's the word you're saying? I'm not an overly fan of people hunting like that. I know it's... Jesus. I know it's, um... You know... Normal, I guess. Especially for places such as New Zealand. Yeah, thanks for the technology. Roast us? Who? Roast us? Who? Yeah, I'm not that person that be hunting really. I find this oh damn. A bite from that spider can kill in seconds. I'd better fix myself an antidote, just in case. <laughs> I'm so good. I don't like that spider. And I'm pretty sure Nick would hate that actually. Right, um, well, I know where the eyeballs are coming from, but just why? That's really creepy. Okay, mm -hmm. that's disturbing, really disturbing. I don't like that. <laughs> hey, an arrow, I suppose. Not the ever living shit was that spider. <laughs> Okay, I don't know what that is. Oh, uh, was there something in the Alamac about that one? Was there a better journal button I can click? Uh, uh, <laughs> no, I am fine with that thing. <sighs> as soon as the eyeballs just creeping and staring at you. That's nice. What? These monsters trap birds just for fun. I can try to force them open. There you go. You hey, bloody bastard. Fuck you. Trapping a poor innocent bird for your own amusement. People have always accused me of helping Baba. Called me a, a freak. When Zora disappeared too, there was nobody left to keep the angry mob away. So, here I am. Finding my sister is my only option now. I need to get to the Red Oak. Yep, yeah, my sister. What is this? <laughs> I just opened a chest like that. <laughs> I can't click right now because my um, fingers are bloody sweaty. <laughs> oh, let him go, you prick! Asshole. There's something in there about that. Bird trap, yep. Mm. <sighs> yep. As I thought, I was almost tempted a little bit to shoot it, but it's like... The arrow would probably fire a little stray and, you know, try and kill the bird. So, yeah, that was the last thing I wanted to do. <laughs> if that amends my deed of shooting one earlier. Fucking Christ. Alright, so... Oh, I'm going under that. That was only right there, okay. I thought, I thought that was a giant object in the background, just saying. I was just gonna make that little bit of thing so in, but you know. Um. Bye. Oh, bye, rain, I suppose. What was I about to say? Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, yep. So the game does tell you that was terrible the same shot. Damn, what a catch. 
At least the game does um tell you uh, if you've made the wrong choice or not. Like the Reservate that always told you Paragon are in the game, so it's nice to know that the this game also does it too. I'm gonna save again. Oh, that replenished a bit of my health. That's interesting. Right, so, yep. Lot, the sun, obviously, is the right way, perhaps. I don't know. I don't know what right way it is. I've played this game before, so. Hmm. Oh. So far, so good. Looks fine. That's a very interesting cocky mechanic, by the way. I like that actually, because most guys just tell you to leave the thing on the campfire and just eat that way, but. Alright. Best status icons display various superhero conditions affecting Yaga. Some of them, some of them are positive, regeneration, haste, or focus, while others are negative, poison, slow down, fusion. Oh, that's <coughs> <coughs> that's great, really great. Looking for a lost sister. A lost spirit. Look like one. Hey. Let me just save again so May your hand be just, but your she is patient. I wonder you thought of all those um big signs when you save, that's really interesting. Oh color. What the hell is wrong with this forest? Good question, you tell me though, because I have no idea. <laughs> Okay. Bollocks. Right. Alright, then. Enigmatic. Oh, no, fuck, no, I've said it. Because the eyes and ears all over the forest, they might have a few remarks on your journey, should slow you down. Oh, wait. What? Where did slow you down come from? They might have a few remarks on your journey, should you knock them down. Their remains, Sherlock's, are valuable. Crafting ingredients. Yeah, I thought so. I was like, how, why would you be picking them up? Okay, there's a few of you. That was definitely not English. <laughs> yeah, probably, guys. Oh, no. oh great. Okay, can't kill it, good to know. Oh no, I can. Okay. <laughs> uh, before I go, is there any more, like, eyes thingies watching me? Not the spiders. I might just put the gamma up just so you guys can also see. Just in the by 10. Oh, there's the hut. Oh hope. no. It's the hut. The one we saw three years ago. The same that haunts my every dream. <sighs> I'll just sneak a peek. Look for any sign of Zora. Yeah, judging what they're saying, I'm assuming that this thing is haunting them both, I guess. Doesn't seem like a very good thing to have this here. Where are you leading? 
leaving me. I did not know you could. I forgot completely about the fact that you can just dash. Also, I don't know. I don't know what happened to my heart. Oh no! It's the hut, the one we saw three years ago, the same that haunts my every dream. <sighs> I'll just sneak a peek. Look for any sign of Zora. To my hut, like, can I please see my hut again? Like, what the fuck happened to my hut? <laughs> Very dramatic music, I'll give you that. <clears throat> hey, we. <wait! laughs> that was growing its spice. Okay, then. That is kind of gross. Gross. Hello. I can't see shit going down that way. What happened to my HUD? <laughs> Alright guys, I fixed it. The HUD's back. I can see my fucking health and compass now. <laughs> And my cross here. That was terrible, eh? Again, you guys tell me what's in that heart because I've got absolutely no idea. So, um, I can branch. <laughs> It's an arrow. The arrow should go right through the damn branch. <laughs> I don't know what's inside. You tell me. I'm a little bit off it is, but yeah. All right, you made your point. Do that. I thought something was creeping up on me. Maybe I should leave the brightness at the suggested setting, which was uh, 100. Maybe I should just leave it as is. Hello? I get all the um. Spooky thingies staring at me. Like massive. Hello. They're hissing, huh? Spooky cat, but uh, yeah. Hello. If only I could see you better. You look cute, especially with those eyes. I don't know what the other thing there is for. Hello. My mask. It's trembling. Okay. <gasps> Okay, this is... Do I want to touch this? Oh, skills, okay. You can unlock new skills and upgrades near the cauldron. Each recipe you can... Yeah, requires different ingredients. Some skills are locked. It's shown by the ones I already see there. And require a unique lost page to be brewed. Okay, a lot of collectibles. A lot of collectibles. Proceeded to display info about the skills. You already clicked the one heart. You can brew a potion of vitality now. And use the dash cooldown. Sweet. Okay. Wooden arrows. I need to start picking up some more shit. <laughs> it's 
especially those uh, thingies there. Okay, what the hell is this? Oh, it's this there. Upstairs. I am here. Oh no! It's... It's you! Again. But... This is not a dream. Well, shit. It isn't. Surprised? Don't you remember all the times I saved your ass before? I... What do you... Better get used to it. This time I'm gonna stay for a good while, princess. I'll also help you get out of this mess you're in. Um... <sighs> the roots have overgrown this place. Ugh. We'll deal with it. Oh... Is this... The one who watches over the world. But look what's happened to him. And to the world. Let him feed off of what you've brought. Press the seal. The seal? Your mask. Do I want to do that though? <laughs> you can carry three more arrows of each type. All received healing is more effective. Hex arrow type wooden. Only one hex can be active at a time. You switch between unlocked, hexes, unlocked hexes at the cauldron. Right. Okay, that was something. You know, a trail of crumbs. Those goddamn kids always get their crumbs in the yard. <laughs> oh, you're back, Jesus! Don't do that. Yeah, part of me wants to just see what happens, but part of me also doesn't, so... I'm good, thank you. See a spider, you ugly motherfucker. Oh, you're back too. Great. You know what, let me just find some more feathers and I'll be right back at that door, folks. So just, um... One sec. Okay, guys, I'm back. Hi, guys. Guys. <laughs> and girls. I had to go back to find it, as you can see from my health bar, well, my dumb ass fell into the fucking river back there, so I had to go back that way, so. Yeah, I'm just a twit. Yes. Whoa. Not bad. Oh, this... I was such a fucking idiot. This fucking fifth is right here. God... Damn it. I'm honestly such a twit. Fuck me. Oh, hello. Yeah, I'm gonna have a feeling you guys are bad because they're charging at me. The forest has been crawling with these lately. Noted. What's that? Oh! Health! No, like for the sake of the video, I'm going to turn up the brightness once again. It's that Hello. Again. There's something about it that reminds me of Dragoy. Was Dragoy the guy that annoyed the hell out of you? Oh no, that's uh, yeah, that's friend. Alright, gotcha. How 
god, the bridge is broken. I can't... So you're gonna stand here forever now? I could try jumping over. No. Figure out something that makes sense. I'll say I can jump that. Come on. I love the... Okay. Yeah, I do have to say, I do love the environment of this game. It's very cool. At least I clicked at that first. <laughs> Hello. You're the giant mushrooms I heard about in old folk tales. I never thought you'd turn out to be real, though. What are you? Oh, oh, shoot. A human girl. And she's holding a bow. Should we? Wait. This mask on her face. Don't know why exactly, but it makes her look almost familiar. Not many of your kind coming here. Have you lost your way, girl? Oh, I like her bow. It's such a nice bow. Uh, can I touch it? Did she come alone? Uh, where's Keep she? Keep it down, kids. Can't you see the grown-ups are talking? I'm... I'm looking for someone. And, well, the trail goes over the broken bridge, so... Well, see, Borvi? The bridge is broken. It must have been the fire drake that burnt it. You mean a dragon? A vile, bloodthirsty reptile? No way you've got a real one here. Of course we haven't. A dragon just happens to be the best cover-up for whoever's behind that honey hustle. Anyway, they call me Borvi Borko. Slippery Jack at your service. My name's Yaga. What kind of name is that? <laughs> What's that short for? Quit your jabbering. I can't hear what she's saying. Would you... Would you happen to know another way across the river? Oh, there is no other way, I'm afraid. We could rebuild the bridge for you, but... Or rather have a bunch of beavers do it for us. Yeah, we sure could do this. But we need to take care of the fire drake first. <sighs> Dragons used to be something you would rather hear about from the elders stories about beasts breathing fire eating sheep but honey the beast this bloody hole eater built its nest somewhere in our forest sometimes it sticks its ugly head from a cave and demands offerings honey's enough for it now but the spring's just begun it might grow hungry for meat or mushrooms what a pile of rubbish there is no bloody dragon, just greed, vice, and deception. Honey is liquid gold. It rules the world, corrupts people. <laughs> no wonder someone's using that for their own benefit. And we still can't afford to lose a single drop anymore. Hmm. Guess I won't know who's right until I find out on my own. It seems you've got a really burning issue here with the beast on your shoulders. But I really need to get across the bridge, so maybe we can help each other out? You seem like a crafty lass. Help us get rid of the beast, and we'll get the bridge fixed for you. Well, I'm not exactly a dragon slaying type. Oh, I'm sure you'll do just fine. Go find Rebel, a rather peculiar cursed type. He's a friendly face, even if it's a bit hard to tell. <laughs> He'll tell you what's why. Dragon or not, this thing needs to be taken care of. But you should start by finding my friend, the Noble Grand Knight. And get yourself a good luck charm, such as a horseshoe. <laughs> In any case, you should follow the dragon's roar. The roar. <laughs> Just go to the caves west from here. All right, I'll see what I can do. You hear me though, I'm most definitely a dragon slayer. Adventure I am. Hang in there, Zora. Wherever you are. <laughs> You're right there.
<laughs> okay. But weird, guys. Weird. Well, look who's here. <laughs> okay, creepy and weird, alright? <laughs> Give it a rest. So that's west. Uh, what's this way first? Oh, hello. Try finding yourself first. Myself. Give me that. Am I full in space with those now? Yes, I am. Alright, whatever. Uh, charge! Two birds and one stone. Fuck you. <laughs> Hello. Come on, there's some significance to that. Oh, yes, it's a feather. Place, but never mind. <laughs> save. I love the save mechanic, by the way. I find it quite appealing. Just saving it at. I think I knew this place. I was here, like. It's been a year now. Painful memories. Good. Pain means you're not dead. Yet. Oh, stop it. A Bardock minus a mortal soul makes a shell. Mm -hmm. And their souls trapped in between. Awaiting their That chance. was like the shittiest throw of a spear you could do, mate. Uh uh. Mm. Alright, well, that was interesting. Nice buddy Venus flytrap. <laughs> Ow! Rude. Okay, shoot those things from a distance and try to get a charge shot in, I guess. Get the bird alone! Asshole bloody thing. Interesting signs. Yep, yeah, hi. I know you're right there. Oh. <coughs> Oi, miss. Miss, uh, moment of your time. Oh, uh, good day to you, Mr. Mr. Lava. Not a very good day to be alive, I gotta say. All underworlds are rage. The elders protesting, lost souls reading around, and made tunnels blocked by those awful roads. Gotta dig the terrors. It's got me all twisted. Tell me, miss. Did I go up or did I go down? You must have gone up to get here, Mr. Lava. Oh, yes. That's so. Thank you, miss. I should get back to work. Demons aren't going to milk themselves, are they? Excuse me? What? Milk themselves? <laughs> what? That made little sense, but alright. What? Mushrooms talking, lava talking. It almost half feels like bloody Narnia in here. The hell is this shit? Harun, Lord of Thunder, may your light shine the way. Keep me free as the birds on your sky. What does that do? <laughs> uh. The first reason of second measures to uh, they intertwine times for some events their favor and that doesn't really tell me what it is though. I still don't know what that is. <laughs> Another safe spot. And that cat's there again. You seem to be around a few places, this is you. Oh, you're a teleporter. You're Piri. 
teleporter. Right, got you. Interesting, by the way. Let me save. Thank you. Of life. Keep on spinning my thread. Hmm. Not bad. I, well, it's one way to teleport, I suppose. It's doing it that way. Hello. I'm not taking its life for my own needs. Then why is it there then? <laughs> Ritual statue. Who spilled those to ward off the winter? <sighs> Days of yore. Hello? <laughs> okay. <laughs> if you call that a chest, it's a very interesting one. I do love the environment. They did a good job on the level design, I'll give them that. That's for sure, at the moment. Oi! Jesus Christ, calm the fuck down. I don't want to buy you to into the water again, I don't want to repeat that mistake. <laughs> Make sure I'm not too loud for you guys, so we'll pull back the mic just a little bit. So where am I going? I gotta speak to the person, yeah, but I kind of want to explore first. Oh, Jesus. Oh, nice. Weird, the tiny looking mushrooms. Love it. Pull on that, no point. And two birds on stone! <laughs> nope. Am I full on those? I am too. Bye, Fox. Have a good life. I don't see you. Just a regular stick. Nothing more. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're not wrong. It is a stick insect. Fucking, I'm so shit at aiming sometimes. Oh, no. That only. Get wrecked. Ow! Rude. And food. <laughs> Let the bloody bird go, you asshole. I'd rather kill the thing after I release the bird, you know? That'd be great. Nice tooth. Finders keepers. You can brew an interesting stew out of it back in the hut. And finally become a hero in your own story. <laughs> Is that so? That's a deer. I don't want to kill this one. Oh, I thought I was a bit passive. I didn't realize it was skittish. What the fuck is that? Bobby poison. I don't want to be near that. Sorry. Hello, anybody home? The Gnoll's camp. Well done, Miss Right Place, Right Time. Keep quiet. <laughs> How nice. Someone came to dinner. Too bad he didn't give us a chance to tidy up the place first. So much dirt everywhere. I guess we need to at least sweep the floors. What is this? Okay, the broom. Place the cue to place, place the door in it. 
for the enemies toward it. it additional effects will vary depending on your morality. It can be carted in quick inventory. Get over here, you little piece of shit. Okay. <laughs> they can't resist it. <laughs> All right. Take care. Watch it, you. Yeah. Alright, so it requires a full stack to, um, craft that. Well, there's plenty of sticks around here. That is weird to look at. I'm sorry. Uh, was it... Uh, a broom? Broom? An ancient artifact of great power. But sure, it makes it easier to take care of the trash. But... but what was it even doing here? This thing's got a mind of its own. It found you. It'll be back if you need it. So... we're bound to stick together if you thick and thin. Yes. I'll ride it wildly in the pale moonlight and howling wind and... Uh... Are you finished? Don't push it, princess. Okay. What's this? Two teeth. Love it. Okay, found a gnome camp, I guess. Hello, Foxy. What's the point of these, by the way? I want to know. This is great. This is a little bit false territory at all. Ow. Why did I jump after it? It's <laughs> such a stupid idea. Let me save. Alright guys, I might call the first episode there. Um, definitely interesting this game, it's already off to a really good start. I love the area and such. I just hope you can find this, uh, sorry, Yaga's lost sister. I think it's our goal here, as far as I know anyway. But yeah, I'm going to leave it here. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I will definitely pick this up really soon because I find this very enjoyable. So yep. Yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.